11-2. That pleases the broadcaster. Sent all the way down. The ref waves it off. No icing as the ref wants to get to the buffet. On the backhand, letting the shot go. And we're right across the street from the uh, great buffet over at Mohegan Sun. There's a chance now in front. Steered aside there by McGuire. Nice job by McGuire to keep the flipper low. Keeping it in, Smith. Smith lets the shot go. Smith got the flow coming out of the back of the helmet. That pleases the broadcaster. So important for the youth of today to have cabbage and flow, as they call it, coming out the back of the helmet. Joachim comes out to play it there. Right on the tape there for Begish. Begish couldn't get it out, though. Kept in. Here's Beagle now. Beagle tried to get it in front. A nice play there by Smith to dislodge him of the puck. And Smith, one hand on the stick, takes it out to center. Smith got to the blue line, sent it in. A nice rush and a nice play there by Darrell Smith. A big hit there behind the play. Smith finishes off the check as well. Real good shift there for Darrell. And his other brother, Darrell. Sending it in now, going to get it. That's Tamburo. Tamburo. Sending it hard around. The hat tricks try to come away to center. That hit Kinahan on the way out, so no icing. And chasing it down quickly now, McManus. Here's McManus now. McManus got it out to center. Waiting there was Judge. Judge couldn't get it back in. Here come the sea captains now. Essing. Essing leading the sea captains in scoring. Number 19 in your scorecard with 22 points, 9 goals, 13 assists. Leading goal scorer is Jack Kinahan. He's got 12 on the season. He can really sniper at Kinahan. He's a power play specialist. At least it seems like he scores on the power play a lot, as far as I know, as far as you know, as far as anybody knows. Well, if you say it with confidence, ladies and gentlemen, if you say something enough times, someone will believe you. A fantastic quote by a terrible man. Here comes Kinahan now. Kinahan down the left wing. Kinahan rubbed out there by Drew. True, excuse me. Sent in by Hayden. Sea captains regain the blue line. Delayed offsides is in effect. Thank the maker. The new hockey often. Puck only came out once. Good puck movement. Cutting to the cooker, Betancourt. He buries the biscuit, and Dan Barry takes a quick lead. Now walking in, but yes, letting the shot go. That's waffled aside by McGuire. So the sea captains down one to nothing early. Well, not early on. Halfway through the first stands are just about now. Beagle. Beagle sidestepping the defense there. Walking in, looking to pull the trigger. That was Seth Beagle, the captain of the hat tricks. Showing nice hands there down low. Again, keeping the puck in, letting the wrist shot go. That one's waffled aside by Yoakum. A nice save there. As the hat tricks looking to pick up the pace here. Here's Corkin now. Pavel Corkin slides it across. Fake shot there by Betancourt. Betancourt's already got one today. On it, there's Borms. Borms trying to get the puck out. Back the other way now. Here comes Bagesh. Bagesh up for Essing. Essing down the left wing. Back for Bagesh to flex it in front. Gently roll to the net minor Maguire. Good puck movement there back and forth. By the sea captains. The old give and go. Behind the net now trying to set up. Get it out in front was Bagesh. And that just missed as they got it in front. Going just right over the crossbars. Cutting to the cooker there was Kinahan. Kinahan now trying to get to it. Taken away there by Nafi. Nafi sending it up the boards. and sent all the way out. Not far enough for icing. So tracking it down there is Hayden. Hayden quickly up for Essing, trying to catch the hat tricks. Inner player change, but they get off the bench and get back on. Guy sends it in there for the sea captains. He'll go with you put your best foot forward like you're constantly on an interview. Maybe I'm wrong. We'll see. Time will tell. I don't think uh, social media and the phones and all that are as nearly as bad as people make it out to be. It's just change. People said, you know, the newspaper was a bad thing. The TV was a bad thing. On it now is Hayden. Hayden sending it hard around for Bagesh. Bagesh trying to go cross ice, pouring it down. Kinahan to himself. Kinahan chipping it ahead now. If this Sea Captains can get to it, they got a two on one down low. Behind the net now, circling, looking, looking, eyes up, heads up, back to the blue line, letting the shot go. Smith, it trickled behind the net minder, but true. Got it out of the way. Winding, shooting, letting the Howitzer go. There was Hayden. A nice stop by Maguire. Sea Captains walking off the boards, a little bit of room, pulling the trigger. Maguire with the save. The rebound. One to one score with just under seven minutes. Well, 6.40 to go. I wouldn't call it just under. Slightly under. Got it out in front now. Dangerously to Sea Captains looking to gain the lead. Back to the blue line. Hayden walking the line. Let's the shot go deflected out high. That takes a big bounce off the boards. The net comes off the moorings accidentally on purpose by accident. By the net miner. A goalie would never knock the net off the moorings on purpose. A nice waffle save. The rebound. A big stop there, Maguire behind. Good afternoon, Essing. Again, just went to the cooker, which is what you want to teach young ladies and lads to do. The minute that they put the skates on, you take them to the crease when they're skating around with the little seal thing that holds everybody up that I still use from time to time, but that's not important right now. 
You take him to the crease, you take him to the painted area, you say, this is the cooker, this is where you got to get to. I want to see you get to the cooker, get to the cooker, get to the cooker, ladies and gentlemen, on the backhand. That just went wide. That's Felidi. Let the shot go, steered aside there by Yoakum. That puck just seemed to die there right next to Yoakum as he swats at it with the old big paddle. Into the corner now, turning on it is Moran. Moran left it for Loftus. Loftus tape to tape, and away comes Guy now. Guy stepping to the outside, over the red line, dumping it in, smart play. Always like to get the puck behind the other team's goal line, make them have to come to. Here comes Holton now. As the sea captains go for a player change, Holton all alone waiting for the cavalry to arrive. Let the backhander go. On it there is Essing. Essing looking for the hat trick, ladies and gentlemen. If you can get a hat trick against the hat tricks, I guess that would be pretty cool. <clears throat> As I always like to say during youth hockey, if you get a hat trick, you get to pick what flavor ice cream you get on the way home. I think it still applies at this level. Here's Essing now. Essing. See number 19 leaning in to take the draw, wearing Brian Trottier's old number. That pleases the broadcaster. You might say Joe Sackick. Some of you may say Stevie Y or Big Joe Thornton. All war number 19 because of Brian Trottier. Quick chance in front. It's pushed aside there by Kinahan. Behind the it goes now. Hattricks do get out to the neutral zone. A three on two if they hurry. That one hopped over the stick. On it there for Lidi. A nice job there by Moran to finish the check. A minute and a half to go. Behind the net dangerously there. Nice job by Massingill there. Harnessing his inner Diego Maradona as he kicked it ahead forward. I believe Argentina advanced to the finals. They're waiting to see, I think, the winner of France and Morocco. A nice defensive play there by Radachinko as he let the puck go and took the body. That's good defense right there. I'd like to show that play to my daughter. She's a defense lady. Sent in, cross corner dump in there by Hayden. He absorbs the big hit. Matrix come away now. Here comes Felitti. Felitti stepping to the outside, hounded there by Guy. Guy got a big chunk of Felitti looking like Thornton Mellon with the triple Lindy there off the, th the springboard. Trying to sell it. He's not on my roster. He's on my substitute roster. Their own zone defense, the offense they go, but Messingill thwarted that effort. Here he comes now. Eric Messingill in on the four check. Messingill, such a solid two way defenseman, and that's going to do it with three seconds left to go. On the man advantage. I think it's going to be icing. No, Yoker went out to play as it's waved off. Oh, went the wrong way with it there. Filetti did a nice job there of anticipating where Yoker was going to go to it. So we're back to five on five. Betancourt letting the shot go. That went off Messingill on the way in. Messingill didn't get it out. Betancourt with another chance now. He slides it over to Hattricks. Let the shot go. That hit a hat trick on the way in. That hit Martufi. And it comes away to center. Sent back in. 13.30 left to go here. Here's Essing. Essing over the blue line. Essing looking for the hat trick. Essing wheeling and dealing. Essing took a big hit there. That's Martufi. Finished his check along the board. Smith pinching in on the back end. There's Essing now behind the net. Essing got it quickly out in front. There's a quick shot, a nice stop there by Maguire. That's creeping down low to get the shot off was Hayden. Bouncing puck along the boards, the hat tricks now. Trying to get out of their own zone. Hayden pinching in, sensing a little duress here by the hat tricks, and Hayden causing more duress, getting it in front. Goes right through the goal mouth, hustling over to keep it in. A nice play there by Bagesh. They realize they got the hat tricks running around here a little bit in their own zone, and the bench is further away because it's a second stanza. But the hat tricks weather the storm, get it out to center. Poke checked away. A nice poke check there again by Smith. Smith on the forehand, sends it over for Hayden. Hayden flips it, but not going to get out. As Granacher kept it in. Patrick's walking off the boards now, trying to get to it. Knocked down quickly, Kinahan. Kinahan back the other way now, Essing. Essing over the red line, cross corner dump in. Fresh captain's hap on the ice for Coach Cousins. He was falling down, managed to get the flipper up. And make a big stop right there as the Hattricks were knocking at the door. That's a big time save right there by the netminder Andrew Yoakum. Here this afternoon, wins the draw cleanly. Sliding it over Hayden, Hayden steps to his left, he lets the shot go, I don't think McGuire ever saw that one. He reacted late. Sometimes you react to the sound as it goes by. Pinching in at the blue line, Kinahan. Kinahan kept it in for Hayden. Hayden protecting the puck, he circles the wagon, lets the shot go, Essing tracks that one down. Essing in the corner, attracting a lot of orange sweaters. Trying to come away with it. But the hat tricks thwarted that effort. Turning on it there is Naffy. Lucas Naffy, ladies and gentlemen, number 16 in your scorecard from Denver, Colorado. I think they're supposed to get like a ridiculous amount of snow out there this weekend, if I'm not mistaken. Denver in the Manitoba area. Away from Christmas, you're not supposed to be productive at this point. 
At least the boss needs to understand that, especially if there's a hockey game on. But that's just me. You might have one of those bosses that don't understand things, and perhaps you may want to get on Indeed, get the resume fired up. Here's a chance now, a glove saved there by McGuire as it bounces away from Kinahan. Nice job by the Captain Beagle. The Regal Beagle carries it out to center, looking for Jack Tripper. Here come the hat tricks now over the blue line. Trying to sidestep to check there. Hayden took it away. Once again, another nice play there by Hayden. Here's Kinahan now. Kinahan protecting the puck down the left wing, putting the brakes on. Got it to Hayden. Hayden trying to go back for Kinahan. Kinahan against Beagle. Now it goes back to the blue line, keeping it in. There was Bagesh, who's covering the blue line there for Hayden. Hayden says, thanks, buddy. Bagesh says, no problem. I'll go back to playing forward. Here's a chance now walking in Massingill. Didn't have the ability. I'll tell you, if I, if I had those two things, I'd be a hat trick. But that's just me. Cross ice pass now, chance for the hat trick. Essing let the shot go. Oh, nice flipper stop there by McGuire as he got the right flipper out. So the first power play here in the afternoon for the Sea Captains. Took almost two periods to manifest itself. Makarenko protecting the puck. He's got help. That's Kinahan steered aside. That's a nice save there. Maybe 25 shots, one and a half will go in. Maybe 12 shots, three quarters of a shot will go in. So basically every 12 shots. 13, really. Maybe 14. Moran keeping the puck in. Got it for Essing. Essing letting the shot go. A can of corn there. Nice glove stop. One there by the Hattricks. The Hattricks cleared it and bounces over to Stick of Moran out to center. And Norwich will have to regroup. Over the blue line now, Hayden. Hayden down the left wing, puts the brakes on. Hayden met there by Betancourt. Hayden protected the puck for Makarenko. Got it back for Kinahan, back for Makarenko. Makarenko along the boards. Makarenko, nice job to get it out for Moran. 58 seconds to go. Moran. Sends it down low. Essing, Essing tried to go back door. Did get it there. Makarenko letting the shot go. He's. I've been to many, if not all. And this one's right up there. In on Yoakum, bouncing puck. Essing ties his man up, wins the drawer into the corner. Nice job to keep it there by Borms. Sometimes there was a big chunk of snow that it left behind, so I was like, oh no. Made a chance in front there, went right off the post. Has a bizarre play there, chapping at it was Kinahan. And he rang the dinner bell there, but no one was hungry enough to answer the call for supper. Got to wonder what's wrong with mama's cooking. I bet you a dozen donuts. Oh, dangerously now in front. A waffle save there by Yoakum. That's coming in with Zagorov looking for a second one. The sea captain's got away with a mistake there. Here's Kinahan now. So two odd bounces at both ends of the ice. There's Bagesh now letting the shot go. Well, Essing was lurking for the hat trick. Really wants to pick the flavor of ice cream on the way home, does that young lad? All right. Nice. And that was, a, that was a really good soccer play. But a terrible football play. I ended up playing football in college, too, for a couple of years. I was just on the team, though. <laughs> just because my roommate was on the team. He was like, you should play football. You're a big guy. I was like, all right. I played for two years, but I hardly ever saw the field, thankfully. I didn't deserve to be out there. I can tell you that was, that was what you call a walk-on, walk-on. <laughs> they didn't cut anybody, so I was on the team. I dressed for a few games. Got in on a couple of special teams plays. That was the I was a terrible football player. I should have never left soccer. I always regretted that. Well, anyway, thanks for listening, ladies and gentlemen. I feel a lot better. Here's Betancourt now. Sliding along for Perkins. Perkins got it out to center. On it there, chipping it ahead there was Gronchar. Gronacher, excuse me. Down low, nice poke checked away there by Essing. As Betancourt was looking for his second one on the season. Kinahan now, nice hands over the red line. Kinahan one on three. Kinahan knifes his way through, slid on second period. That took a while. Had the privilege of calling me, but ended up losing by six. Moran on the clean faceoff win. Dumps it into the corner. Another smart play there. And defensemen are very smart here for the Sea Captains. They don't try to force the play. If it's not there, it's not it has led to. Now we have this faceoff because of that decision. It's won by the hat tricks. Big defensive faceoff zone win. Moran pinching in. Kept in at the blue line. Nice job there by Magesh, who was covering for Moran. Danbury trying to come away with it now. Turnover at the blue line. Winding, shooting, saved by Maguire. This is all because of the smart decision by Moran, ladies and gentlemen. You didn't think I was going to let you forget, did you? Here's a chance now in front, letting the shot go. A nice stop there by Maguire as Magesh got this a shot away. In the corner now. Danbury finally now coming out of the zone. 
So all of that because of the good decision by Moran, ladies and gentlemen. That is exactly what we're talking about right there. A perfect example of why the little things matter. A little smart play by Moran. They still, Danbury has still not gotten over the red line because of that smart decision by Moran. There they go. Now it's finally comes to an end. That's exactly what we're talking about right there. Nothing going on at the blue line. Dump it in. Down the right wing now quickly with a head of steam, Tamburo. Tamburo tried to hit the trailer. Couldn't connect there. Danbury protecting the puck quickly now. Perkins. Perkins down the right wing. Perkins ran into a couple of sea captains. They got it back. Sliding it over quickly there. Out of chinks. Martufi's in the sin bin. Either way, it's a power play here for Norwich as they look to regain the lead. Nice job to keep it in by Moran as he tips it to Hayden. Hayden sending it from Makarinko back for Hayden. Hayden, nice job to keep that in. Hayden walks down low, tried to go cross ice. Nice stick in the passing lane there by True. Moran for Hayden. Hayden sliding it down low again. We see True breaking it up. Turning on it there is Essing. Essing looking to pull the trigger. Bouncing puck goes right by the post. Makarinko first on it. Back for Hayden. Hayden switches places there. Leaves it for Moran. Moran, they keep trying to go back down low. But again, we see True getting a stick in the passing lane. A nice job there by Brody True. Lost the handle on it. It's sent all the way down. A minute 15 to go in the man advantage as Yoakum quickly moves it up for Makarenko. Trying to catch the hat tricks in a player change. Cross ice pass. Right in stride for Kinahan. Kinahan with the drop pass. Essing with the move. Essing walking in, pulling the trigger. A big stop by McGuire. And then Danbury clearing it all the way down. Well, a nice play there by Yoakum to get things started. And then Essing with a golden opportunity there, but McGuire with the save. 50 seconds remaining on the power play. As Radachenko slides it across, it's sent all the way down. Yoakum took a weird hop there for a moment. He sends it hard around. The hat tricks corral the puck there. Danbury setting up in their own zone, trying to come away with it. That's going to go for no icing. As they're shorthanded, I apologize. I was going to say icing there for a second. I was incorrect. Felidi lost the handle on it. Here comes Peluso now. Peluso over the blue line. Peluso with Essing. Peluso sends it down low. McGuire chips it ahead. Norwich gains possession there. Back to the blue line. Kept in Massengill. Now sliding it over. Walking Loftus releasing. Now how it's a tipped in. Makarenko took a high hit there from Bettencourt along the boards. But the sea captains maintain possession. Hayden winding, shooting. That went off the stick there. Just under six minutes to play here. A big offensive zone faceoff win back to Moran over for Hayden. Hayden at the dot. Hayden cross ice. Little bit of room now. Pulling the trigger. McGuire looking emotionally from my perspective. Di Pietro would disagree. Another faceoff win is Hayden. Hayden circles the wagons. Hayden sending it down low for Makarenko. Leaves it for Hayden. Back for Makarenko. Makarenko walks to the center for Moran. Makarenko wants it back. This one goes cross ice. Now he's got it back. Makarenko pulls the trigger. Doesn't get through. A nice job there by True, but can't get it out. Stop on Makarenko. Sending it down for Kinahan. Kinahan got it back. Kinahan got a nice win back for Makarenko. Makarenko sliding it over Essing. Essing cross ice pass. C button one tire by Kinahan. That just failed to click. Oh, great puck movement there by Norwich. As Makarenko tracks it down. A minute and, a, and five seconds still remaining on this man advantage. Nice pass over for Makarenko. Let's the shot go. A man in front there. That's big Tim Hayden. Hayden going right to the crease and causing havoc for the netminder. Moran straight away. For Essing. Essing at the dot. Essing walks off. Essing lets the shot go. One hit a body out high as Hayden tracks it down. Still 40 seconds remaining on this power play. Makarenko fakes the shot, leaves it, Essing away to Moran. The cycling continues. Moran for Hayden. Hayden down the left wing. Hayden, cross ice pass there, fired it just a little too hard. And finally, the hat tricks can get some fresh legs. Norwich trying to prevent it, but offside. Burrow buries the biscuit. So under a minute to play now in regulation. And there will be sudden death or sudden life overtime, depending upon who you're rooting for, should it go there. Or who you've got money on, which would be who you're rooting for. There's Kinahan now. Kinahan over the blue line. Kinahan sends it in. Dan Berry rallying the puck there. Good puck movement. Sent out for Winicki. Moran gives him a little shove. 
No icing as it ends up behind Norwich's net. I'm sure Norwich would like to get the puck out. Doesn't, don't do so though. Quick shot, doesn't connect on it now. Winicki, Winicki back for Radachenko. Radachenko slides it over, kept in at the blue line, letting the shot go, bounces away now. Kinahan in a foot race, Radachenko coming over. Bodies go flying air, picked up by Essing. Essing trying to wheel and deal his way down low. Lost a handle on it, coming over, turnover now. Kinahan trying to find it to pull the trigger. He does a big stop. Very good to get your Gatorade after the game there, buddy. Sorry I ever doubted you. All right, so the hat tricks. They win the faceoff, look to set up shop. 3.45 left to go here in overtime. Here come the hat tricks now out of their own zone. Almost turned it over at the blue line. Now they do. Essing looking for the hat trick. In the corner is out there with Kinahan. And Moran, Kinahan now walking out left it for Essing. Oh, that just failed to click as the net was yawning. Back the other way now quickly. Lost the handle on it there to Degorov. Degorov sending it hard around. One of the hat tricks fell, so quickly now Kinahan up ahead for Essing. Essing with one man to beat. A lot of room. Essing to the outside. Tried to cut back to the inside. A nice defensive play there by Tamboro. Now Tamboro's got the puck. Tamboro away with it. Tamboro down the left wing of Gorev. Gorev. All alone as the hat tricks go for a play. Chase Agorov with the move to the backhand. A big stop there by Yoakum as he kept the flipper down. Under three minutes to go now. Quickly now, Messingill. The ice is very rough out there at this point, though, ladies and gentlemen. He goes behind the net. Radachinko against Messingill. Messingill digging, mucking, trying to come away with it, trying to win possession for Norwich. He's still digging, still mucking, still doing his homework. Fresh legs out there. One fifteen remaining here in the overtime. Wholesale changes by the sea captains as Kinahan's out there. With Essing and Hayden. Hayden now could get the turnover as they catch Danbury in a, in a player change. Over the blue line on size. That's it for Essing. Essing softly across. On and now is Jack Kinahan. Kinahan's got Essing. Essing had, he had the trigger pulled. He was ready to sniper it. Under a minute to go now. Yoakum has made a couple of dazzling stops here in the extra stanza. Slides up for Hayden. Hayden dangerously there for Kinahan. Kinahan up for Essing. Essing down the right wing. 38 to go. Essing on the backhand. Let's the shot go. Big stop by Maguire. Back the other way now. Here come the hat tricks. Down the right wing with a head of steam. A two on one. Walking in at the dot. Pulling up. Letting it go in front. Letting the shot go. They 